Okay, welcome to my CVS haul for 521-2016. And as always, Savvy Saver here, and I'm going to go ahead and scan through the receipt now. So I picked up some really awesome CVS scores. I haven't been in a while, and uh, being a new mommy, i got to maximize time. So that's why I'm whispering, because baby is asleep and it is early in the morning. But um, I just wanted to take advantage of this time while I didn't have baby on me. So I'm scanning through the receipt now here. Excuse the mess. Okay. Alright, so let's go over this haul. So as you can see, um, I didn't get too, too much. And I'll show you just real quick. I got two of the Colgate Totals. The free toothpaste score that was advertised in the ad. The two free Aquafina or Pepsi deal, which you'll see right there, and that's on the app only, you guys. So download your CBS app because you're missing out on some freebies. Um, got my water because I'm trying to get a little bit healthier, um, slowly but surely. Anyways, uh, and then the Calendula or however you, the heck you say this cream. This always ends up having really good deals every once in a while, and it's back. Um, you got six extra care bucks back on this, and I believe it was eight forty nine to begin with. Um, but then I scored um, a three dollar rebate back from Ibotta and a two dollar rebate back from MobiSave. So all in all, I got five dollars in rebates plus. The six dollars in extra care bucks or ECBs as we call them in coupon world um, for that one. So that ended up being like a six dollar money maker. Heck yeah. Okay, and then one of my favorite products for my little girl Anna Ray is the Baby Ganix products, and these things are very pricey. Like just one of those sunscreen bottles was eleven ninety nine. Okay, normal price, just to give you an idea, and that sunscreen stick and the little travel pack was $6.99 each. So Baby Ganix isn't cheap, but I, I really like to put safe product on my child um, and for our family. So uh, what was really cool, and I've never seen this good of a deal on Baby Ganix products. I actually had manufacturer coupons that I emailed the company saying, I love your products, but it's really pricey. Could you send me some coupons? They sent me a $5 coupon and a dollar coupon um, for a certain amount that you spent. So I used that and stacked it with the Baby Ganix since we're on that. Um, and they ended up having a really good deal, and I'll show you the ad where it's at in here, for buy one get one 50% off all Baby Ganix um, products. And there we go. Okay, so of course, being a couponer, I was like, heck yeah. And then it got even better because I it's not advertised in the ad, so make sure... I mean, I guess it is in a big box, but it's easy to miss unless you really understand how to do CVS. But you end up getting a $30. When you spent $30, you got 10 extra care bucks back. And there they are. Boom. So how I did that was I spent $30 threshold, obviously. Now, if you're doing the buy and get one 50% off, make sure you go slightly over the threshold. So I think I got it to like $40. So after all said and done, it brought me down to the $30 requirement still, even after coupons, to qualify for the $10 in extra care box back. So I stacked that with my $6 in coupons from manufacturer coupons that I had. So all in all, I got $40 worth of the Baby Ganix products. Yes, people, that is $40 worth. I know it's hard to believe that. Um, but I got the $10 back of the extra care box over there. And then obviously saved a ton getting half price on Obviously, the lower cost items are going to be the half price items. So I got those for half price, plus the six dollars off made it like I think ten bucks for all of that. So going from forty to ten dollars for baby organic organic products, that is a huge win for me. That that is probably my most excited deal I've ever had um, when it comes to baby products, especially the organic ones because they're really expensive. Um, so that's that. And then the Calendula cream, just to go back to that, um, I got the six extra care bucks for that. And that was a seven dollar money maker. I could not find that in the ad, so just pan through your ad or whatever, but I did. And I could not see it, but I happened to notice it because I follow a bunch of coupon feeds. Um, but anyways, yeah, just make sure you go on the app because it was there on the app when I, um, went online or on the computer, however you do that. So make sure you're not missing out on any extra care bucks, um, 
opportunities. So with that being said, we're going to move on to the water now. And that was just self-explanatory. I briefly mentioned, but that was completely free on the app only. Um, you got to get $2 off any two Pepsi and they were on sale. So that made it um, free. And just to show you in the ad here, the breakdown a little bit more, this one is advertised. You could get Pepsi or Aquafina. And they ended up being two for two dollars, and then with the app only savings, obviously it makes it free. So free water, hooray! Um, okay, so going on to the Colgate deal and wrapping up here, um, the Colgate toothpaste was actually the freebie item featured, and I'll go back to the ad here so you can see that. And it was actually this time in the ad twice in two different places, but it was a limit of one per household, so keep that in mind. But there's an instant coupon, that big tower red box that you see in the store, don't pass that. Scan your card and keep scanning it until it stops spitting out coupons, because a lot of times people stop it once after they scan it, and actually I do it at least twice and it spits out more coupons. So keep scanning your card, people until it does not print out any more coupons. Unless you see it repeating the same coupon over and over and over again, then stop. <laughs> I did that one time and I think it ended up printing out like 15 in a row. It was ridiculous, but it was the same coupon after I ended up looking at it. So pay attention to that. But that's the freebie item. So yeah, the 50, 50 cent, excuse me, uh, manufacturer coupon that was featured in the Sunday's paper. Um, and then stack it with the instant coupon that comes out of this red box. Um, and that's the coupon center, then uh, make sure you get that coupon and you will have a free toothpaste. Boom. All right, and then last but not least is these Colgate mouthwash, and I will show you the deal in the ad here. Again, more extra care bucks. I am all about that. And here's what it looks like after it gives it to you on the receipt. And the extra care bucks will always print on the end of your receipt here. So you can kind of see where I cut it off here. And also it will tell you what you qualified for and if you've reached your limit, so pay attention to that as well. I know I'm really going fast over this. Um, if you want more in depth on how to learn how to shop at CVS or any other stores, stay tuned. I am gonna be going down and doing couponing 101 videos for those of you who are new to couponing. So don't freak out. You'll get the hang of it. Just bear with and keep going. It gets easier the more that you do this. And the greatest advice I can give to you new couponers is just start small. So do one or two little items that you think you need or um, have a good deal, and uh, then you'll be up and running and rolling and um, off and running on how to roll extra care bucks so you're constantly getting free items and making money every single transaction. So don't give up hope. Um, it took me a little bit to get the hang of things, and um, so don't think we all just jump in and we know what we're doing here, all right? It's trial by error. All right, so for the last deal here is the Colgate mouthwash. Obviously, there are two per household. I just did one because I only had coupons for one deal, so I had two of the $1 off coupons um, to stack on top of this, and I got back the $5 extra care bucks. So this ended up being free with a slight money maker. Um, I don't know the exact amounts, I apologize for that, um, but like I said, I will go through um, and do breakdowns more in depth. I just wanted to give you a highlight and an overview of my CVS haul here. And uh, this is Savvy Saver signing out for um, CVS shopping trip on 520-2016.